What's up? I am back. In this video, I'm going to show you on how to install the IntelliJ IDEA 2022. Before we proceed in this tutorial, make sure you downloaded the IntelliJ IDEA application at jetbrains.com. You may choose the Community Edition or the Ultimate version. So I have the Ultimate version and let's get started. Once you have downloaded the application and run the application, this window will show. So let's go next and you can choose the destination folder of the application. So I'm going to leave this as default. And here you can check the IntelliJ IDEA to create the desktop shortcut. And if you want to open a folder, for the project you can you can check here you can check that and also check the add bin folder to the path that's important so here at the create associations you can select any of this language if you are developing java or groovy you can check one of these so i'm going to select java and click on next and install. All right, so the installation is completed. You can choose reboot now or I want to re manually reboot later. So I think I'm going to manually reboot later and finish the installation. And I'm going to run the application. So check this one. I confirm that I have read and accept the terms and click on continue. Don't send if you don't want to send. So here since I am using the ultimate version of the IntelliJ IDEA, so I'm going to log in my account. All right, and I'm going to sign in my Gmail. All right, and activate license. So my license is for edu educational use only. So let's close this one and go here. So click on new project to create a new project. So let's try creating an, a Java project and let's try hello world. and select the language Java and IntelliJ. Since I am using JDK 17, if you don't have the latest version of the JDK, you can download from here. Something like that. Since I am using the LTS version, I'm going to use the 17 and create And here, this is our project. The download pre-built shared indexes is running right now in the indexing JDK 17. So let's wait until this one is finished. So let's create a Java class. Right click and 
new and java class so let's name this uh, class as main and make a new line type the psvm hit on tab to create the main class so let's try to run a hello world or print the hello world on the console so type is out and hit on tab to make the shortcut of system out that print ln and hello world all right and run this program right here run main and there it is hello world so let's make another project so if you want to create a javafx project you can go here at the file and click a new project so let's try creating a javafx project select the language java and build system choose the maven and let's name the project as um, fx example and choose the gdk and click on next and create project new window so it's syncing <coughs> and i think we can run this application right now and click here to run the application all right it is running right now so this is the window and if we click the hello button welcome to javafx application so that's it and i hope you learned something new in this tutorial please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and i will see you in the next video